All right, I'm back from our quest. Today we're going to be playing, I'm going to butcher the name again, Chrysotile? I don't know, but I did I play the first version of this? I believe I did. But anyways, we're not playing that today. We're playing whatever that says. So I'm not exactly sure whenever this will come out. It might be during E3 or after E3, but regardless, this is recorded before E3, and I'm all about that, so I'll be focused on watching that stuff. So I'll definitely have to come back up here after I disable this. So here's where we get stuck for about, well, thanks for freezing game for like 45 minutes to an hour. Gotta fling myself or use a funnel. That shuts that off. Is there a way I can... We'll keep it here just in case we get the funnel somehow. Although I doubt it. Yeah, we have to go up there. And then I can walk up that way. So that's not going to work. Game, could you not like skip every two seconds? That'd be great. But yeah, I love E3. <laughs> I watch most of the conferences. I skip Ubisoft because that's weird. I hate how they present their shit. Everything else I usually watch. I don't know why I'm saying this. this is probably going to be over by the time this is uploaded. Oh, I can, I can go up here, and then I can go over there. That should work. Okay, so we got heart cube here. Companion cube. I just pissed off people by saying that. Can I just toss this up here? Probably not. I have to just use... Do that, and then we'll do this. Oh, I don't have a way of getting through there, do I? Hmm. Should I have went through with it? Possibly. Let's try that. Although, I don't think I can see that angle from over there. No, I can't. Oh, you know what? No, do it from up there. I can definitely see that from that angle. That's the height I want. So I gotta just put this back under this, like so, so I can do that later. And then I just gotta get across again over into there. Probably just gonna fly through there. Oops, not through the map, but just to speed that up a bit. Because now if I do this, and then I do this, once that goes in there, I should be able to see over there. Now what portal do I use? Probably just to, I guess it wouldn't matter really, because I'd have a way to just get the cube through. So we'll do that. We'll take the easy approach. So yeah, there's a button right there, right? Yep, okay, so we'll set that onto here. And that enables us to go up there. I don't think that's the first step. I think in here there was a button, right? Yeah, we do this to get this cube onto here. Because you want to get that other cube sitting in there first, I would assume. Well, here's an idea. If I take this, if I put this here, because this is slanted, so it leads me to believe I have to fling myself rather than use the funnel, because the funnel would just put me up there anyways. So if I fling myself, and I was thinking, oh, that's right. <laughs> My mistake. Let me step on this to put that up there first. Oh, but I can't do that, so I gotta put the cube on there. Technical difficulties with my brain at the moment, so let that just pass for a second. There, so now we go and put this on that button. That enables the top part of the fizzler on the ceiling to be disabled. And I'm thinking... Well, and... Can I see the ceiling from over here? Oh, no, I can't. And I'd probably just do it the opposite way. Yeah, that was, that was dumb. Do it the opposite way. Put the cube on the other button, and I stand on that. Should work. Because then I could just easily walk back. And I, then I can drop down from the ceiling. 
right? I don't know what I'm talking about. Look, I'm struggling over here. Is there even anything on the ceiling for me to do that? No, but I can definitely jump off. So which one should I use? Orange? Yeah. Although I'm going to fall through a fizzler. That's not going to help me. Can't you tell I'm getting confused? I feel like I'm just there. I'm almost there with it. It's just a combination of this and that button. Yeah, I don't see how that would work because there's no way for me to be able to jump off of that. Although, could I see that? From down there. If I went and did that again. That might work, actually. Let me let me check that. It's a long shot, but maybe. Oh yeah, I can. Look at that. Oh, there we go. That solved that. Now I don't need to drop through the ceiling. Probably until later. I can just drop off of here, right? Yeah. There we go. Please be different than the other cube. Thank you. Usually means a cube swap coming. So, should I leave this one? That's going to be the tricky part. Where do I leave this cube? Do I put it back over there? I guess I w Okay, well, I guess I would put it on that because I could get the other cube redrop it in there, redo everything, and then also have that off at the same time. And probably just put the funnel there. Hmm. Well, we'll go with just putting this up here for now. And we'll see what we can make of that. So I'm going to repeat these steps to get this cube back to be where we were, and I'll be back. Okay, so we are back in this spot. And actually, can I hit the ceiling this time since I have that off? Yes, but will that help me? Because I could probably take this cube through to the top. We'll see. We'll just do that for now. Oh, and then I just get the funnel somehow. How the hell I would do that? There's gotta be a way to get that funnel. Because even if I blue portal, I can probably just open up the door if I really wanted to. But I, I don't know how to get the, the funnel in here yet. It's still a mystery to me. Maybe I missed a step where I have to get the other cube to do something. I don't know. You know, I think I see what I have to do. It has to be similar to what I did uh, to fling myself up to the cube. Because if I put this here... I think... I'd have to... I can go up there. And then jump off. Uh, but then I'm going to lose the... Now, see, I can't just jump off. There's no angle that I can see that. Unless I do it from up there. Like, I don't know how high I can get that. If I do it and jump through... It doesn't help me, though. I would just fling through. Unless I can fling through this gap. And then fling myself up into the funnel. Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, so let me go reset that up again because I'm pretty sure I need this back in the other room. Yeah, I definitely can see the highest point of that. So if I do blue portal... Look, I totally didn't miss. Okay, be quiet. Well, I guess I could just put the cube up there. Like that. And hopefully it doesn't... Oh, that's right. Hey, I did it. Oh, I actually grabbed it on like the thousandth try. So we go straight up, and then we just go over here, and we should be done. 
That was not too hard. It just took time for me to get the fling right for this. That took the longest, actually. So I'm probably going to cut out a lot of that for you. Really nothing to see there besides me missing the jump by overshooting it or <laughs> not grabbing the cube. But yeah, I'll give that one a solid 8. Statistically speaking, there are actually people playing worse than you. I'm not surprised. Have you seen some of the front page maps, GLaDOS? But yeah, I'm going to give that an 8 overall. Solid map. Not the most difficult either. I believe this was medium-ish to hard difficulty. I'd say definitely on the medium side, for me at least. But with that, I'm done for today, and I'll see you next time.